Yo, it's your girl, Robert Cream, the movement in a building with my big bro, the man that make everything happen all the time already like spaghetti, Big City MG, Big Cry about the Vine. So first thing first, let us know, like, what's the story behind CDMG? So CDMG is something that I started to help out artists in the city that really don't really, you know, kind of know what direction they want to go in. We step in, we kind of help them out with that. And then we help them build up their profile and everything. And then we help get them out here in distribution. We got a distribution deal with Empire. So they get distributed to about 750 digital stores versus, you know, you go to TuneCore or CD Baby. They only had about 250 stores. So it's a nice advantage that they got. Um, so we, what we're doing is building a team, an unstoppable team that really is just trying to make ends meet for their family, make residual income for, for years to come. We're not thinking about just now. We're thinking about years down the line. You know, these these artists got families that they need to take care of and stuff like that. So we're thinking um, long term versus short term. So CDMG is basically a publishing and distribution company. And we step in and we, we help, help artists get developed and get on their feet and get running off the ground. So um, that's mainly what we do. And I'm, I'm the CEO of the publishing company. I started it. It's named after my kids. So I feel like, you know, it's something that it's going to last for a long time to come. Even after I ain't here no more, it's going to be still going. So that's what we're looking for, long-term success. So, I mean, shit, okay, like he said, you know, uh, let us know, like, how you like the show, like, how you like working with all the artists in your, on your team, how, how you think their performances was, how you think it went tonight, you know, like, talk to us, let us know a little glimpse. That shit was fire. <laughs> hey, the whole team went crazy, went berserk on the stage, man. If you didn't, if you didn't see the performances, then you ain't gonna know, you know what I mean? What we gonna do is we gonna try to do this probably once a year, twice a year, so people can be able to see it. We gonna get out here in the streets, man, and we gonna get off the internet, and we gonna get out here.